Hi, it's Jai here from Beyond Wiz. Today we're going to take you through um, rescans and scanning in uh, new channels. So, basically, what's happened this week is SBS have launched a new uh, world movie service, um, and some boxes are having trouble. You, you might be turning to that service and getting a, uh, a black screen with just audio or, or no picture and audio altogether. So, what we need to do is just do, need to do a, uh, a rescan of your services to make sure that all comes in and starts working properly. Um, so there's a couple of different ways of doing this. We can do an automatically f an automatic scan of, of everything and uh, or we can just do a manual scan of just the new service. Now this will apply to to any future services that might come on that have problems with them. Some of them will just come on and work but uh, others you may need to do a rescan to, uh, to, to receive. So what we're going to do, so we're using the V2 uh, today for this demonstration purpose but this also applies to your uh, T2, U4s, uh, T3 and T4s and then your older boxes too, I'm not sure how the DP series handle it but um, but you may have to do a rescan with that as well. So for the T series and the the, the U and the V series this, this video probably applies more to. So what we want to do is go into the menu <coughs> and then go into setup and then we want to go down to tuners and press OK and this will bring us over to the next menu. So these are the two different things we can do. So if, if you know if you just want to scan the channel that's changed or you know the frequency or the channel that's that, that's changed we can do a manual scan and I might do that first because it's probably the quickest. Um, but if you're if you're unsure we're going to just do a full location scan or a full scan um, and it'll put everything back in place but we'll go through the manual scan first of all so we'll go down to manual scan and press OK. And then we know that in, um, well in Sydney at least, that, that SBS is the, the, the channel that we want to, uh, to scan. And SBS in Sydney is on um, 184.500 megahertz or channel 7. So if you've got this information, this information will be by default here, which is predefined um, transponder. Um, so my region is Sydney, so it'll only list the Sydney channels available to scan here. Um, if you're doing a full scan, or you're, um, or you're in an area that, 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 you know, it's moved frequencies for some reason, you can enter this number here by changing that to, um, to manual. But I think for most cases, this video, this, this setting is probably the, the easiest one to do. So we're just going to choose um, channel 7, which is SBS in, in Sydney, and just scan that frequency only. The one thing you need to make sure of, if this clear before scan, we need to make sure that we change this to no. Because what that's going to do is if you leave that to yes, it'll only then have your SBS channels that you've scanned in your system. It'll delete all your other channels. You won't get anything else. But if you do clear before scan, we're just going to make sure that we keep all the other channels bar the one that we're scanning. And then we're just going to hit the green button to start scanning. And you should see here that SBS will pop up quite quickly. Okay, so that's now scanned in all the SBS channels. We'll wait for this to go to complete. <coughs> And then once it's complete, we're just going to press uh, the OK button. So there you go, it says that it's now complete, so we're going to hit OK. So the next thing we want to do is we want to exit right out. Now one thing we have to change is, now this is just going to have the last scanned as your as your default bouquet. Um, by that I mean is that the only channels that are going to appear in your EPG are the ones you've just scanned. So what we need to do is we need to go back to your full bouquet. Uh, the easiest way to do this is you just hit the favourite button which is on the uh, V2 remote up the top here. It might be in a different spot on your other remotes but hit the FAV button or the favourite button. Hit it twice and that'll bring up your three bouquets. Okay, you want to go up to Terrestrial TV LCN and press OK, and then just press OK on the first channel in the list, and that'll make sure that it changes your um, your bouquet to have all your channels now listed. So if we go back into the EPG, you'll see that all your channels are, are in the EPG, including your new SBS ones. So we'll just test that theory, and we'll go to uh, SBS. I'm not sure on the LCN, but we'll just go up to... Uh, there we go, so SBS World Movies, and that's the new uh, World Movie channel that's now scanned in and ready to go. And you should see EPG for that information, that movie, that show as well. So the one thing that won't be here yet is in this firmware, at least by the time this video you're watching this video, it might be, is that the pick-on's not available yet, which is a little channel logo. Logo that'll come in a in a in a future firmware. So next, now let's just go through the uh, full scan. So again, you go into Menu Setup. 
down to tuners and then across to location scan okay if your location is listed so we list by basically by population the top 10 or 15 um, cities in in Australia um, so if it's listed here you can choose that city if not you can just do the Australian full scan so I'm just going to do Sydney and press OK and it's going to scan in all of the Sydney services okay I've just paused the video while that's been happening so that takes probably uh, oh, I'd say about a minute to scan all the channels in if you're choosing a location if you choose a full scan it'll obviously take longer possibly about two minutes okay so that's there it's found 48 channels now so again we just hit OK to continue we're going to exit out to live TV now again what's going to happen here is, is the pictures frozen because we've, we haven't launched into a bouquet yet if I just press the channel up that'll fix that um, but what we're in now is we're in the la again in the last scanned uh, bouquet which means that there'll be no um, logical channel numbers so it'll basically be in the order it's scanned from 1 through to 48 so we just want to change that again so you just hit your favorite button twice we're going to go up into the terrestrial TV LCN folder and press OK on the first uh, on the first channel and that'll make sure that all your channels have all your LCNs and logical channel numbers. Um, so that's it on that video. So as I say that applies to anything. Anytime you need to rescan you can just sort of uh, that's that's how you do it. And the important parts again are to make sure that um, you launch back into the correct bouquet in the end so all your channel number numbering goes back to where it was. Alright, thanks for watching.